class is in session. The professor is in. What's happening, y'all? Andre the Giant, the Irresistible Force. Here's our first surprise uh, for the month, the first seventh anniversary surprise revamp superstar. And you might need to take him on the road to go against a six-star Bam Bam. Let me show you how to take care of it. You don't have to. In my case, I took him up to six-star to get the bonus. So if you want the bonus, you need to take him up to six star. But if you don't take him up or you can't take him up, uh, you don't want to spend the money on the portal to get the six star fuse. That's okay. I'll show you how to win anyways. Now you don't need a strap. You also don't need medals. But if you do put medals on there, whether they're Furies or Fury 2s, they'll help you kick out, which is probably what you need. Uh, mine is just a uh, Rainmaker plate. So it's nothing, nothing fancy that's on him that way. His revamp is in a couple places. One of it is right here, the Power Slam. Choose seven gems to make into yellows. That's the same, but it's now a reversal. He is now a Power Gem Killer. If anyone makes a Power Gem, we steal all of them. <laughs> and then we take their turn and use their Power Gems against them. It's basically, why are you hitting yourself? If y'all have an older brother, y'all know exactly what I'm talking about. Uh, so, this is what's going to happen. Steal their turn. You're going to smack them afterwards. His sub also got a nice boost. It now does about 200k per turn. And it's now a choose. Choose to make red gems. And then they turn into reinforce afterwards. So going with the double red with the yellow, you actually don't need to use the sub. And you're actually not going to use the sub that much. You just need double red MP. Over here, you can put Butch. It doesn't have to be Roxanne. You just need red MP and red MP. And on the back end here, you can go for gem damage. What I did on stream was actually add more submission damage. So that way you can use the sub closer to the end to make it go faster. But you actually don't need any sub damage. You actually don't need anybody on the back end over here. You can just go, you just need two red MPs and that's all you need. Well, let's bro. So if you are able to do this, if you are able to defeat him with a six star bronze, you get that loot coin, you get seven of the loot coins, one for each of the surprises, then you are guaranteed a six star silver character from that mega loot at the end of the month. Don't go spending it now. Don't be that person. Y'all know what I mean. I'll show you at the end of the video what I mean. So we want to leave him with a red match. We don't need to use anything. We want him to use this move right here. This Bam Salt is going to make a whole bunch of power gems that we are then going to steal and steal his turn. So we're just going to get out of the way and let him make his red move. Beautiful. And now we're good. <laughs> now we just play the waiting game. I'll fill up my sub. And so he's going to hit this move first. As he does, he's going to cascade around. Beautiful. All right. And now it's going to be our turn. I am going to get rid of his X breaks as best I can. That's what I'm going to be using my power slam for. So my power slam basically is to get rid of his power gem. So I can do one, two, three, four, one, two, three. And so that right there gets rid of all of his power gems. He just doesn't, I just don't need them on the board. It's more of a pain than anything else. Excellent. He's going to use his power gems. This is why and how it's so easy. And reversal, my turn. Our reversal goes off. These are now all ours. So the other thing that you can do um, is rather than get rid of his gems right there, um, you can keep your turn going. So what we're going to do is actually hit the sub at this point. Um, we're going to turn these into red gems. So let's fill up our one of our red moves. So that's six. That should fill up our move. And then we're just going to put red gems on the board. And this, because we broke some gems here, the power gems are going to go off and we're going to do some extra damage. He's not going to get a chance to break all of these, or at least we hope not. And now we still have power gems on the board. And so we are going to make a five match over here. We'll put another yellows up there. Power gems go off. 
We got an extra swipe. Take the swipe. Power gems go off again. And then we're going to hit the sub again. The sub a dub dub. Shout out to the daviest of these. Uh, and then we are going to allow the sub to defeat him. And now we're done. And we took minimal health. Easy peasy. So if you're able to defeat that and you actually took him up to six star bronze, like I did, then you will get a loot coin in the final milestone. You'll also get a brand new plate in the milestone before. You don't need him six star to get that new plate. And more on that new plate, if you don't know, then I will be talking about it tomorrow on the main channel. Tomorrow being Thursday, February 1st. But otherwise, uh, we'll go over that in more detail. What I meant earlier, if you go into loot, here's that loot coin that you're going to get. Do not spend this loot coin until the end. Collect all seven, because if you do collect all seven, then you are guaranteed one feature. And that one feature is a six-star silver character. And there are a lot of good ones in here. And there are a lot of older ones in here. It is a luck of the draw. The bro is already calling it. I will get Ivar of the Viking Raiders. So I'm calling my shot. I'm getting Viking Raiders six-star silver. And because it's a pull of seven, you will get one of these at six-star silver, and then you will get six others at six-star bronze. Some of them will be fuses. Some of them will be brand new to you. In any event, do not spend this loot coin. Do not be that person. All right. Thanks for coming to class. Appreciate y'all being here. Professor out.